Yeah, my, uh, the name of the single is uh, it's called Falling. It's a song I wrote about a year ago and I just uh, uh, got it fully produced in a studio at, uh, well, with my producer Tom Camp and uh, we're working on releasing that shortly. It's, it's a work in progress pretty much so whenever we can get it out there, we'll get it out there. Ah, the songs that are going to be on there, it's, the, right now we, we got a handful of songs, I think we're going to, me and my uh, producer and uh, uh, a gentleman, I, I can't remember his name, but he is a co-writer for uh, Tyrone Wells, uh, if you ever heard of him, uh, he, we're going to work on a few songs, so I, I think right now we got three songs, it's going to be uh, Home, which is a song of mine, Falling of course, which is already finished, and, uh, and we're negotiating the third one of mine. We don't know which one yet, but then we're going to have about five or six on there. So right now we're in the writing process of, of, of all those songs for, for that EP. It's going to be called the Pendleton EP, so up under Jay Paskey. I played professional ice hockey when I was, for most of my life. Uh, so pretty much my, uh, my hero in that was uh, Mario Lemieux from the Pittsburgh Penguins, of course. I'm from Pittsburgh, so yeah, pretty much uh, that would be my superhero because I've, I've just followed him for many years, you know, and he's, he's always been an inspiration to me. Very so cool. That's my, uh, that's kind of my superhero. And I know, I know, I used to, that's what I grew up watching, I grew up watching them guys, and uh, they were definitely, uh, Pretty, pretty much all of those guys were an inspiration. Anybody that was in that level, you know, this is always where I wanted to go. Never made it to the NHL, but I made it very close. Uh, as you can see from the scars on my face, still look all right though. Alive, Dave Matthews. A lot of my acoustic inspiration has come from him and just, just the stage presence. Jason Mraz, because, come on man, that guy's a god. Like, this stuff that he does live, it's just so incredible. Gavin McGraw, because my vocals, I, my vocals really improved after I met, not met, I actually, well, I actually met Gavin McGraw before his famous, but I only got to chat with him for a second, but once I saw his singing ability, that's when my singing ability improved, because I studied his, the way his vocals were, and that's when I, my vocals got you know, more powerful. I used to have a real low tone and real raspy voice, which didn't really work. But then once I really learned how to blow up my voice, you know, after Gavin DeGraw, so definitely him. What is that, three? Uh, Johnny Cash, of course. I want Johnny Cash. And the fifth person, probably Sublime, because he just, I think he could have, man, if he was just around longer, man, just imagine the industry and, 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 and the way music could have been if he was around longer to, to shine, you know. On my social networking, you can find me, uh, you can find my band page on Facebook, it's uh, Jay Paskey, it's J-A-Y-P-A-S-K-I, that's under my band page, and then you can find my main page, which I do a lot more of my marketing on there, it's uh, Jason Pascarella, which is my full name, it's, J-A-S-O-M-P-A-S-Q-U-A-R-E-L-L-A. -L -L -A. It's long, but I know it's... I'm, that's why I shortened my name to Jay Paskey when I'm on the stage. Today, so. And uh, what else do I got? Oh, I got YouTube, but it's not, it's not really anything special yet. Uh, you can find that under Jay Paskey and Jason Pascarella. Instagram. Hey, my name is Jay Paskey. I just checked out the Wu Manchu Chronicles. Go check it out. It's awesome.